What's up YouTube, it's your boy Mish, I mean, what's up YouTube, it's Mission Pegasus, my car channel. So right now, today, I'm going to the Baltimore Convention Center for the Maryland Auto Show. It's going to be my first time, today is June 15th, and it's open for the other day, Sunday, because today is Saturday, so they got three days of it. And it opens up at 10 a.m. It's currently 7.35 a.m. I woke up early, got dressed, trying to um, plan for it because the plan is, I live in the county, so the plan is to um, like park at a light rail and take the light rail up. So that's our best bet because I'm, I'm not trying to deal with parking. And my father's going, possibly my neighbors too, they're gonna roll with us. So um, yeah, we're not trying to deal with parking, so we're gonna take the light rail up. And I'm gonna vlog that too, get some uh, B-roll for you guys. And stay tuned for that. <laughs> I, this is like my fifth time recording this, cause I kept messing up, so bear with me. But, um, Let's get it. So change of plans, we actually found a ride, so we'll be heading out soon. Where we would have got off at. Yeah. So we still been on it for 40. <laughs> right here you pay for your tickets and then hit down you got the lego man uh -huh. here they got the yards i think it's the yards nah just the gr corolla pretty clean though Check that inside out. Ooh, come thick. That's hard. Look at the entertainment system. And we got the GR86. Nah, GR86. Clean. I'm seeing that. It fits you though. We got a ton of new cars here. Some Camaros, some Vets. Clean, but I think that's a Z06. Grand Sport. GTO. Yeah, you got a little drag radio on the back. Truck must move. And it's so simple. So simple. Yeah. Huge turbo. Checked out the Jeep and Chrysler section. Got some food over here. We got some souvenirs. I'ma go ahead, hold on. Grab the 66 Chevelle. Got to. I got a black one at home. Look, got the new Z. They got all types, Lambos. Fast and Furious section. GTRs and Chargers. Nice. 
Did it feel that finish that feels like a sheet of glass? Oh, yeah. Now you may have seen the infomercial where we wiped oh, the front spray. We spray painted part of the spray paint with an acid test fire marker and put a kibosh on the let me show you the water test. For my luck is I wash my car the next day. It rains down to the beads. So it's a one-two punch. Every six months, once a month, it's $44 for the microfibers. The nail with a screw on my First Got the Genesis section. We already grabbed some food. These trucks are nice. Nice Impala. Enjoy some 68, bro. Yeah. Big blue joint, but it's four though. Mm -hmm. But the front, the grill, all that. The hood was the same, remember? Mm -hmm. Remember I had the little wheels like that? Yeah. The caps, everything was the same. <laughs> That's just crazy, ain't it? Yeah. So the joint's four though, and I had the car. I don't even know what type of car this is. Buick Rivera. Nice. So we ready to eat. I got the burger with the fries and a Sprite. Uh, for both our meals, it came up to $35. So not too bad, but you know, expensive. <laughs> but we gonna still check out a couple more cars. The tires on this thing, man. <laughs> I don't know if I could drive one of these. They a little too big for me. I like my, I like my coupe and sedans. I like that joint though. I could drive that. Yeah. Look at that dash. So I actually seen one of these with uh, R35 GTR wheels and it was slam stance. That joint is pretty clean. This, this new one is a clean body style. Myself, here. We'd love to talk more about the Explorer with you. We'd also like to get you signed up for our Look at that cabin space. All electric F 150. Wow, you get like a Tesla screen. That's hard. Pretty spacious. Oh, this is the Lightning. Yeah. Got the Raptor. Genesis <clears throat> new electric car, I guess. Watch this thing take off. Oh, we backing up. Here you register for the ride along experience and the electric car. And you get to pick what type of um, car you in. I picked the Genesis to test it out. And now I'm in line. So this is my second time in an electric car. First one was a Tesla. But we ain't go like super, like take off fast. So. <laughs> Uh, Russell. 
Russell. Like Russell Wilson. Yeah. Russell Simmons. Both. Okay, okay. I said Russell Athletics. Yeah. Nice to meet you too. Thank you. What's your name? My name is Diamandi. Diamandi. Yeah. That's exotic. <laughs> So we're going to use the boost button that gives us an additional 429 no, no. It goes from 429 horsepower to 483 So it's additional 54 horsepower for 10 seconds Okay Yes, I'm ready Woo! <laughs> Wow Wow Okay, we're not going to use the boost button We're going to launch a second time Okay <laughs> wow. Russell. That was great. <laughs> no, nah, but now I know what 400. 83 horsepower feels like. I'm not sure. Okay, I didn't tell you I was clicking the clicker. So that no. means I didn't do it. Oh. Alright, just check. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> So my dad checking out the Z. This joint is clean. The GR86. I would actually consider getting one of these. Feels just like the Supra. Um, and just alike with the um, the new 2024Z. Um, or 400Z, whatever you want to call it. This is real nice. As you can see, I'm back at the crib. I had a wonderful day. Today was just great. I got to sit in a Supra GR86, which I wouldn't mind having either one of those cars. Also the Z, I wouldn't mind having one of those. Great cars, but very tight to fit in. I'm not much of a big person, so it's perfect size for me, but some of the people getting in those cars was like struggling to get out. <laughs> It was funny, but I got some souvenirs. So this is a 1966 Chevelle that I got um, as a souvenir for going to the um, Marilyn Auto Show, just for memories. But also right here is a black one that my grandfather um, customized. As you can see, it has white interior. He actually, had a few of these um, 
back in the day. And his was customized just like this one with the gold and the gold on the back. Um, rest in peace, uh, Grandpa Jimmy, Jimmy Chapman. Um, he gave me this before he passed away. And it's just so crazy that I found a red one today, the day before Father's Day. And it just makes me think, man, like, just why? Because he actually had um, a 164th scale of a black 66 Chevelle and a red 66 Chevelle. So just crazy, man. <laughs> and then guess what? I ran into my uncle there and we was chatting. He told me how he had a 240 back in the day. I forget if it was a Z or an SX, S chassis, but um, he used to drift Baltimore streets and stuff back in the day. I thought that was real funny and cool. So I would like to thank all of you for watching. Thank you. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. And I'll catch you on the next video.